dirt. Fuck. Did it just stop? Look at that, you piece of shit. That's really... Wow, whoa, 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 whoa. Going back and forth between the two. Oh, come on. I've got to refresh the screen because none of them the chat. It just goes black all of a sudden. And then, and then it does come back. We had this conversation last week. Steve German had a funny joke. <sighs> Fucking hell. Oh, Lisa. <laughs> your other brother is your uncle. Okay, that's weird. <laughs> it's making me watch an ad right now. Are you? Fuck. Of course it made me log in again. What a great, great to see Lisa again. She hasn't been able to watch the show. You missed Kim that was in earlier. She has to get up really early. Wow, and it's doing a show for the ladies. <laughs> God, retard. No, what? No, it didn't make you watch an ad. I asked this question and then Columbo. Yes. Uh, he actually, he can do a good Columbo. Um, so, yeah, God, I love Columbo. Lisa, are you watching Breaking Bad? Or Amy, for that matter? Fuck. The series, and, oh, my God. Oh, my God. It's like every... I read a review. It's exactly right what they said, this review. They crank it up the tension. They cranked up the tension every week and never let up. Was, and yet it's like... These stupid little... De oh, it's so good. Oh, my God. Get it and watch it. From the start. Brian Cranston. He's... You're never... It's... It's, real, it's weird at first when you see him and you've seen Malcolm in the middle and the goofy dad and then in this it's like totally different oh my god I don't know yeah look it up online even on like YouTube or something AMC AMC okay I'll say it I don't like to say commercial ad amctv.com they have Oh, the one guy did this karaoke that was, that was so gay. It was... If you like musical stuff, you would kind of kick out of it. But, oh, holy shit. Anyway, Vic, uh, Dexter was too dark for me. Dexter was too, like, I watched a couple of episodes and that was like all I could take. But this is like, I don't know, it's more nuanced and ambiguous or something. But shit. Okay, and this, this is like season four, and there's one more season next summer. Dexter. Oh, that was too messed up for me. That f fucked with my head a little bit, you know. And you know the guy in that was from Six Feet Under, and I enjoyed that in a, like, non-homosexual way. Anyway. Yeah, it was... It was funny, the friend that I killed, we used to be a part of the show the first year of my show. Six Feet, you meant to type Six Feet. I don't know if I like the way they ended it, but, um, anyway. So the guy, this, that's the guy from Six Feet Under, the gay brother that was the star of Dexter, and it's, it's messed up. But just this, uh, I don't know, I don't know why I identify with the guy in Breaking Bad. 
because he's just like trying, he's trying to get, he's trying to get by, he's, missed out on all the drama of Utah FM. I know. I know, but I, I kind of enjoyed the non-gay brother with all his, his um, sex affairs that he would get into. Oh, Utah FM crashed and burned. Look up, I can send you the article. In fact, it's on the Awkward Hour fan club page. The article in City Weekly, that ex it kind of explains it in a short way because they didn't have a lot of space. Just, they're trying to, they got kicked out of that building because of the crazy real estate lady. But um, they had problems too. And I got pissed off because they changed the door code and I go down there and they didn't let us know. It's like, they talk about, yeah, we need to communicate better. And I'm like, yeah, or communicate at all. At all. It's, it's a, it's a volunteer. Nothing to do with the economy. Spootidity. I must type spootidity as stupidity. No, well, they, that was part of it, I guess, economic. They weren't raising money like community volunteer, you know. They weren't doing like, in August they had a fundraiser. I was thinking about going to it and it ended up not. And it turned out it was fucked up. It was messed up. The sound guy at the club was drunk and all this crap and it was a mess and just the people that are running it are just, I've had enough crap. I'm done dealing with half-assed people, you know, have them helping me on the show. Speaking of, I was mentioning Cal Wood because the one night I saw Dexter, I was hanging out with him over at his apartment. I watched a couple of episodes of Dexter, and then, I mean this in a non-gay way, we had a, this is fun, we had a Quantum Leap Marathon. <laughs> uh, uh, that's, that's a fun, Quantum Leap, that was a fun little show. <laughs> that could be, I can see how... But then he would be a woman and he'd be in a dress. Or, it was just goofy. I can see how that could appeal to the, anyway, different lifestyle people. Anyway, comment. Say something about that. Are you hearing me still? Anyway, and then I'll ask a question because there's a delay. And then someone will type yes and I'll be, yes what? Because I've moved on in my head to something else, and they'll say yes. And she said, she said, yes, yes what, yes what? Oh, like three questions ago, because I'm frazzled, Mr. Frazzle, Mr. Frazzle Fry. Oh, God. Oh, Jesus. I'm just trying to work overtime. Oh, I heard some crap about where you work, Lisa. I'll talk to you later, I guess. This isn't the...